Hey guys, welcome back to the Struggleville YouTube channel. I want to do this video on a Diamond VC500 USB video capture device. Um, I want to show in this video how to get it to work on Windows 7, Windows 8, and Windows 10 because it can be kind of a pain and there's nothing in the documentation that would tell you how to get it working. Uh, first, for those of you who don't know what it is, it's just a USB device. As you can see from the picture here, this is just... Um, inputs so any kind of VCR or video game or anything with either an S video or AV jacks you can plug it in and display it on your computer I bought it to back up old VHS tapes and to record games for like YouTube videos and stuff so I have a Windows 10 computer and I was really uh, disappointed when I went through and installed all the drivers and the software and when I opened up the program that comes with it which is this easy grabber I opened it up and I just got a black screen now it's fixed now so it does show up blue but you probably if you are watching this video you're having a problem with just having a black screen so the thing is is there is a uh, um, a USB driver in the device manager that is conflicting with the drivers you need here and you need to either uninstall or disable that driver so if you go to your search just type in device manager it's right there I already have it pulled up and you're looking at this one right here this says eHome infrared receiver uh, it may also be called Microsoft eHome infrared receiver so basically the same thing but a little bit different and as you can see I have disabled mine you can either it'll say disabled here if it's already enabled or you can uninstall it and if you have not already installed preferably you have not already installed the drivers of the software for the VC500 so if you hadn't installed anything and you're watching this video beforehand make sure to disable this thing first before installing anything if you already have the stuff installed and it's not working you are going to need to reinstall the drivers um, for me, as soon as I disabled this thing right here, it might have been up beforehand and I just didn't notice it, there was another driver that displayed up here that had exclamation mark on it saying it wasn't installed or wasn't working properly. And it was called OTG102. And once I clicked on that, I hit update drivers and for the source I selected the CD-ROM that I had the disk in for the VC500. And I told it to go ahead and update the drivers, and after it was done, that turned into this one here, USB 2.0 Video Capture. So, once you do that, then you might have to restart your computer. I didn't have to. Open up the Easy Grabber. And as you can see, if it ever comes up, I have me some Golden Tee Golf. It's the great one with the little wheel on top, the little thumb wheel and everything. I love this little game. But anyways, it's really cool. You get to record whatever you want. And this will get it working on Windows 7, Windows 8, or Windows 10. So, if this gets it working for you guys, let me know in the comments below. If you would like to get your own VC500 and don't already have one, I'll put a link to that in the description below. Make sure to give the video a like. And if you're not already a subscriber, subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching, guys.